I wanted to share this mini album I had made. Um, I had bought, got a bunch of uh, these clear acrylic albums a couple of years ago. I can't even remember from where, but they were like a dollar a piece. And of course, you know, I ordered like 20 or more. I can't even remember now. And um, so I decided to go ahead and use one for this project. And I have a hard time with the acrylic because, you know, you want, you want it to show through. But then again, you know... You've got this open space, but then what if you have stuff showing? So, I, anyway, this is it. Um, all the cuts are from the Cricut cartridge. Uh, it was either called Christmas or Noel. And let's see if I can tilt that a little bit, bring that in a little bit. Where, And then I used a stamp that says, Being together is the best gift of all, which is true about Christmas, I think, anyway. Um, you have to bear with me with my video skills here. And, uh, now the, these little, uh, holly leaves are actually a Martha Stewart punch. And then here is the first page, and I used the reindeer. And the white is actually what the receiver can use to use as a guide to cut their picture to make it fit in that area. And... On here, I added a few little uh, hot thick stars. And this kind of looked plain, and that kind of looked plain. So I went ahead and stamped it. says, The magic of Christmas never ends. Its greatest gifts are family and friends. And then uh, this is a uh, ribbon slide, a snowflake ribbon slide. And of course, I had to have a Santa Claus. And I cut out the season's greetings. And this is right here on his hat is also a Martha Stewart punch, as are the snowflakes. And over here, see, like I said, all these cuts came from that cartridge. This was a, a border punch that I used. And on one of the tabs, I did add um, a little stamp thing that says peace and joy. And then over on this one, it says holiday cheer. And then I stamped a little merry and bright. This is kind of hard to hold and do this. And then um, I added the snowflake cut here. And then I went ahead and did some ribbon and a snowflake charm. And I just taped that on the back. That way uh, they can make sure to be able to pull off the paper. And so this is not glued down here. It's glued up here and then right here. Uh, and it has mounting foam. And then we have a bell. And then the little poinsettia, and then I just stamped a Merry Christmas there. And as you can see, I think I got that a little bit too close to that hole there. And then on the back, I just added a big uh, gift. Because I didn't want to leave the back completely plain. And then on the, the rings, I just added some different ribbons. And some of these ribbons were used inside, too. Uh, like I know this one was. And then this big, thick, white ribbon was used on the inside. But I just wanted to share that with you guys.